Hello everyone, so now I am going to share my new assignment to create a waterfall chart uh, showing how test results are changed. Okay, so I am provided by one Power BI report uh, and uh, the data shows the number of com completed tests by exam for each month of 2018. Okay, this is the data set. So exam name, month number, month name, test taken. These are all the columns present there. And I need to create my waterfall chart showing each month the two leading causes of the change in the number of tests taken. Okay. So I need to create the waterfall chart like this. Okay. So I will show you in the Power BI desktop how I did that. Okay. So this is the data. This is the test data. Here are three, that uh, four columns exam name month number month name test taken okay so uh, okay after importing the data set uh, we have to do a waterfall chart so uh, we have to go to the visualization pane and select this waterfall chart from there after selecting this we need to specify the fields okay so uh, here uh, i have taken the category as month name okay then in the breakdown exam name and in the value so test taken okay the value of test taken for that particular month okay so uh, then uh, i will show you how i did so these all are the uh, categories uh, increase decrease total and other okay so uh, this is the increase is uh, shown in the green color Decrease is shown in the uh, red color, total is shown in the blue color, and the yellow are others. Okay, so for FD, uh, uh, test taken, a uh, number of test taken in April uh, for in on office 2016 is increases. Okay, this is the increases. This were office 2016 increases, war 2016 increases. Uh, basic computation is increases but uh, other is uh, other is uh, there and excel 2016 is increases excel 2007 2010 it is a decreases and uh, then august then august uh, power powerpoint so this red color shows decreases okay and this is the other so here the other categories is uh, other categories more then um, uh, we can see uh, that data likewise and uh, here in the May month okay so here is also the decrease categories are more and uh, yes uh, so uh, in this way we can analyze the data for the number of tests taken uh, for particular subject or uh, and uh, for particular years month okay so this is my assignment of waterfall chart uh, thanks for watching my video